Hello everyone and welcome back to Ride Free. Today I'm filming another Choice Day vlog and I'm also going to be talking about the Brooke charity. So I hope you all enjoy this video. I also just got dressed and I'm wearing my Esme hoodie and my plum carrot uh, breeches. So most people only think that I own a horse, but we actually own a bunny named Holly. So this is Holly. She is a mini lop bunny and she's really adorable. So I think this morning I might cut up some carrots for the horses just to give them a little bit of a treat. So now I got all the carrot chopped up and now I'm going to put my boots on. I also got all my tack stuff out here because I had a lesson last night and I don't have clips of me riding but I do have one certain clip that Cassandra wanted me to put in the video. So that was a clip of me with Sally and Sam and we were trying to make them do some like pole work and like pole bending almost. So it was actually quite fun. Cassandra wanted me to put it in the video so that's for Cassandra. I'm also going to be taking my tack box today because I'm not going to be riding but I do want to give Clipper a really good groom and same with Lucy. Um, Cassandra might groom Ben, but we're not sure yet. We're gonna figure it out when we get to the barn. I think while I'm waiting, I'm just gonna tie up my lead rope so it looks a little bit nicer. So I have just arrived at the barn. I just opened the gate. Hi, Benjamin. Clipper's like, how did you get through there? Going that way, girly. And when Cassandra gets to the barn, we're gonna turn the horses out to the big field for a little bit. They usually get an hour on grass and then they come back into their paddock. So now I'm gonna start on Ben's paddock. Oh! So I just finished doing the paddocks. And now it's time to do stalls for Ben. And Ben keeps his stall fairly clean. Like it's not really that bad half the time. All we gotta do is just respread the sawdust out everywhere so it looks neater. So now this stall is clean and now I gotta do the other one right there. 
So I finished this stall. And the reason why I didn't film doing this stall is because I did the other one. So it's kind of a little bit boring, but I finished it. So now, oh, she's covered in hay. So now we're turning out the horses into that big field over there. And Cassandra's here. She's in the tack room though. Got Lucy here. Then Cassandra brought Clipper in. So I'm doing Lucy's stall, which as you can see is a little bit dirty, but the inside of her stall is really clean. And Clipper's stall is it's actually not a clean. Pink side yeah. today. That's really We're nice. We're really proud of him. Yeah. That's an achievement. And your mother talked to him yesterday telling him to be cleaner. Yeah, yeah so I'm impressed. Cassandra also gave me this phone holder, which I'm really excited to use, that she made in metalwork. We just put sawdust on there because Lucy likes to poop in that spot and it just makes it easier to pick it up. So I'm now doing Clipper in Lucy's paddock and it's actually fairly clean. And all the horses are over there. Now I'm going to dump this wheelbarrow. And whenever we dump a wheelbarrow, it goes into that corner and then people come and pick up manure. There is a goose on top of the hill. <laughs> There's little goslings in there. Aww. Very cute. So we finished doing stalls and paddocks and now we're gonna put up the hay bags. So as you can see, there's a hole, and we Lucy. don't like that. Yeah, because of Lucy. <laughs> and we do fix holes all the time, because all the horses Ooh. do like to make holes. At so least once every day. We're going to fix this hole. Yes, you know, twice. Yeah. She's dealt with a lot. She's dealt with more holes like this before, so I'm going to fix it, though. 
so now we got the whole bag done and now we gotta tie a knot and then we gotta cut the strings so the, horse, the horses don't eat it. Now that you're done tying it, you are going to cut it so your horses don't eat this whole thing and get colic and die. <laughs> That's basically the main cause of horses dying. Colic and die. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Voila. How to fix a hay bag. We also get all of our riding stuff from Greenhawk. Best equestrian store there is. Yeah, it's a really good equestrian store. Greenhawk is really good. And also the girls that work in our They're town so nice. are so nice. They so today I'm gonna be talking about the Brook Charity. The Brook Charity is a charity that helps horses, donkeys, and mules all across the world. What you can do is go to their Instagram page, which I'll put in the link in the description, and you can donate a few dollars to help horses and donkeys around the world that are in need. The Brook Charity also helps build shelters for different equines all around the world. You can go to their Instagram pages, and they have different options for you to choose from to help. Without those horses and donkeys, lots of women and men would be put through lots of heavy and hard work. They have different options on their Instagram pages that you can choose from. You can learn about their history and different parts about the Brook Charity. If you don't mind helping out, you can go to their Instagram page and donate a few dollars. Go. The Brook Charity also helps build high play. Brook Charity also helps build shelters for different people. No, not for different people. Go. I don't have a whole lot of horses that need help. You can go. Oh my. Stop. So today I'm going to be talking. Go. So today I'm going. <laughs> oh, charming, Liz. <laughs> <laughs> Lucy, what on earth are you doing? 